Hello everybody, welcome back to youtube.com slash geekloud for another Let's Install. Today it is Little Nightmares 1 and 2 Bundle PS4 and PS5 Edition. Now, we're downloading both of these uh, today on the PS4, obviously, but note, buying the bundle gets you the PS5 version of Little Nightmares 2 only. So on the PlayStation 4, you get Little Nightmares 1 and 2, both native PlayStation 4 versions, but when you buy it as this bundle, you also get Little Nightmares 2 native PlayStation 5 edition. Uh, and if I back far enough out here now somewhere, hopefully, we will see just there the two items downloading. And if we pull up the notifications, okay, look at this. We can see Little Nightmares 1 onto a PlayStation 4 is coming in at a total download size of 4.102 gigabytes. And Little Nightmares 2 is also installing and that itself is a separate 7.2. 663 gigabytes that is for little nightmares one and two on playstation 4 if you're a playstation 5 person out there interested in the little nightmares 2 playstation 5 let's install video please let me know in a comment of this video or anywhere on the channel and i'll be sure to also do little nightmares 2 on playstation 5 upon request but for now let's install little nightmares bundle one and two right here youtube.com slash geek aloud Installed Little Nightmares 1 and 2 onto a PlayStation 4. I should note it's a PlayStation 4 
Pro, which has had the old 1970s platter hard drive ripped out of it. They all come with it by default. With one Phillips head screwdriver, you undo one screw, take out the old platter hard drive, slot yourself in a solid state drive, modern technology, halve your load times. It's very simple to do. As it halves your load time. It's well worth doing as well. It costs you about one game. Approximately the cost of one game, you can get that upgraded drive. Very straightforward. It's so easy to do, in fact. If you expand out the description of this video, there is a link, a step-by-step -step guide of how you can do it yourself. It takes less than five minutes. It's well worth it. You should definitely check out the video and then set some time aside for yourself to upgrade your PlayStation 4, be it a base PS4, you know, launch model, the more modern slim ones, or the pros, any PlayStation 4 can have a very simple one screwdriver uh, applied to it and halve your load time. It's well worth it. All right, now we're in Little Nightmares 1. Let's open up the settings, see what they've got for us. A controller map, perfect. Always like to see those. Brightness, definitely take the time to set it up for your environment. You don't have the two big studio lights to contend with. So we'll leave that there for now. And Master Volume, they are the only options uh, within Little Nightmares 1. So let's uh, bounce on out now. Pull up the particulars for Little Nightmares 1 while we're here. I can tell you Little Nightmares 1 PlayStation 4 version is currently version 1.07. And that is a full and complete install size of 4.11 gigabytes. That is, of course, Little Nightmares 1. Now, let's give Little Nightmares 2 the exact same treatment. We'll open it up, we'll have a look at the settings menu, see what kind of options are available. Once we're satisfied with it, we'll back back out to the PlayStation 4 uh, dashboard or desktop, call it what you will, and we'll pull up the particulars for this one, and then we will wrap up this Let's Install video. As I said, if you're keen for the specifics on the PlayStation 5 version of Little Nightmares 2, send me a message. I'm all over the place online. Uh, just let me know, at Troy J in most places. Uh, and if I get a message requesting it, I'll be sure to produce a Little Nightmares 2 Let's Install for the PlayStation 5. Well, I'll already dock them a point in number two for making us scroll through a bunch of legalese at the start. No one likes it, and you can't tell me that's legally enforceable because I don't believe anyone other than a lawyer has ever sat there and read them. Please do not power off your console. All right, settings. What do they got for us? Master volume again. Nothing much there. Language English. Thank you. Brightness. Once again, don't go by my settings. Set it up for your environment, though. Controls. Another controller map looks about right. And the option to reset the settings now. But that's almost the exact same options there. So let's pull up the information for Little Nightmares 2 and wrap up this double header of a Let's Install. Little Nightmares 2 onto a PlayStation 4 Pro currently version 1.05. And that is a full and complete install size of 7.68 gigabytes. Thank you very much for watching another Let's Install right here on Geek Loud. Please check out the rest of the channel, specifically the Gaming Enforcement Agency. It's our video game podcast where you get to see our footage and hear our thoughts and hands-on impressions of all the games we love to play here at Geek Loud. What else could you do with the channel? Like it, subscribe it, you'll never miss it. Oh, that was luck. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> that's something. <laughs>